Hello everyone, it's Tuesday the 23rd of March today, two and three, so it's about having faith, having faith in relationships, partnerships, because there is a spiritual reason for all things and you are here to grow, to learn, to understand, to teach others and also to learn yourself because we're all in the school of life. So the message is, as I release all criticism, judgmental people leave my life. So this is saying to you, you know, as you don't care what people think, when you start releasing all of that and letting go and, you know, not taking anything personally, anyone or anything that puts you in a situation of judgment, it will automatically leave your life. Why? Because you're operating on a vibration that doesn't attract that. Your vibration is away from that. So anyone will leave your life that criticized you, judged you, blamed you because you just don't care anymore what anyone thinks. You know how you feel, you know who you are and you know what you want. And it's not your business to care what people think. Who cares what people think? What matters is what you think and what you know and what you feel. And I accept everyone as they are, including myself. So when we move into that energy, we also move into the energy of acceptance, where we accept ourselves, flaws and all, because we understand that we are perfect as we are. And that we don't need to change to fit in with anyone else or do anything we don't feel guided to do. We just have to follow our own heart and listen to our truth and know who we are. And then we accept ourselves, and we accept others. And we realize that everyone is doing the best they can with the information they have in the situations they are in. So if someone is hurting you, you know, lashing out at you, trying to cause you pain or bring you down, it's because they are hurting themselves. Hurt people hurt people. So when you understand that and you look at it differently, by being the observer of your life, you realize that that is an opportunity for you to grow because what triggers heals. And when we get squeezed, you know, when someone's really shouting at us or upsetting us, when we get squeezed by that, it's what comes out of us that shows us who we are. Do we get squeezed and react in fear with blame, pain, bitterness, anger, frustration, or do we respond in a loving way with kindness and empathy, sensitivity and understanding of what they are going through too? That's how you know what's within you because when you get squeezed, what comes out of you is who you are in that moment. Like when you squeeze a lemon, lemon juice comes out. Orange can't come out because it's a lemon. And the angels are reminding you of that today. And that's a kind of, um, you know, Wayne Dyer, the late Wayne the, the, the late Wayne Dyer, the great late Wayne Dyer, used that as, you know, a symbol of who he is. You know, he spoke about that in his seminars and he said, when you squeeze an orange, orange juice comes out. So remember when you're getting squeezed and you're going through struggle, whether it be something at work or something your family is saying to you, someone who's winding you up or, you know, your twin flame or a trigger situation with a karmic person, if anything's getting at you, what's coming out of you? Because that's showing you who you are and then you know what you need to work on. So you know you need to relax, breathe, take a moment and observe why it's happening. So when you release all criticism, you move out of that energy and those kinds of people and situations will naturally leave your life. And then you accept everyone and everything as it is and your life will feel better. So I'm going to pull us a card today from the Psychic Tarot of the Heart. So thank you, angels. What do we need to know today? Wow, okay. Let's try and bring the top one off. It wouldn't even like me shuffle them then. Okay, that's the cards. I have to do what I'm told. So I'm going to put these back, okay? Because I really feel that that's the card. Unless any stick out now. Oh, there we go. I'm going to do these then. So I've got four cards. So the first one we've got then is observe. Well, that's why then. Okay, we've got observe and we've got the number 12. So 12, obviously, the other way around is 21. And we're in the year of 2021. So I feel between 2012, which was a massive year of awakening, and now 2021, it's really been an opportunity to observe everything in your life. And it's a time of awakening. You know, it's a real energy right now of awakening. So 2012 was a big year of awakening and that's what we're going through now. So people are waking up to the truth about who they are and what they want to be doing in their life. So you're becoming an observer of your life. 
and we've got giving and receiving so remember that what you give you receive so if you're giving out pain and stress that's what you're getting back to you but if you're in the opportunity or you know in the energy right now of giving and loving and being kind and generous and observing everything and accepting things and not judging anything that's exactly what you're going to get back and we've got rest and reconsider so it's a great day to have some time out you know to work on self to rest and reconsider and i feel this as if something triggers you or gets to you or puts you into the energy of fear they give me a little bit of fear there a little bit of burpee energy so it's a time to rest and reconsider a time to recharge so instead of reacting respond with love take a moment to rest and reconsider your reaction and instead respond in love and open up because you know things are opening up to you opportunities are flowing in and magic so when you release any criticism or any judgmental energy the doors will open and your heart will open and the hearts of people you are involved with it will open and you'll speak love you know and they show me this kind of not being able to speak properly or there could be some misunderstandings that get understood when you see things differently so if anyone is struggling to communicate in a situation could be your twin could be you know family member it could even be you open up be more open to things to see things from a different perspective and realize that hurt people hurt people and if people are judging you blaming you criticizing you it's because that's how they're feeling within themselves so don't take it personally and then you'll open up to the truth about who you are who they are and why things are happening the way they are and you'll feel better stronger more in your power because you're becoming an observer of your life so anything that's happening to you saying okay that's happening for me to grow me to learn me to teach me what i need to know and you're stepping into the energy of power from this i hope this helps have a great day sending you so much love and i'll see you soon